Kaylin Clark had yet another record-breaking night in their game against the Seattle Storm. She went off for over 20 points, 9 assists, and broke the rookie WNBA assist record. She's currently leading the league in assists. She's right now 11th or 10th in points per game. She's having an absolutely incredible rookie year, and it's the reason so many people have actually been paying attention to the WNBA. But as we've stated from the beginning, there are so many people in the WNBA that absolutely despise her. And it does clearly seem to be jealousy. They can't stand that their league has been a complete and total failure. For two decades, it's it's lost money. And now they have more attention than ever before because of Caitlin Clark. But the people that have been there for a long time, they're pissed that all of this relevancy is coming because of her, not them. And Seattle Storm star Skylar Diggins-Smith is catching some heavy heat from a lot of people, including Shannon Sharp. And, you know, this all started during that that game after the Indiana Fever took a big lead and a timeout is called and you know Caitlin Clark's on the floor telling the crowd to get loud things like that and Skylar Diggins Smith you know gave her a little shot kind of for no reason here it is right here <laughs> And she can try to play that off as if, oh, I was just walking there. No, she sped up. She sped up to try to get there to bump Caitlin Clark while she was headed to the bench. Watch it again. Look at how she starts power walking like she's in a competition or something just to get up there. And then a few minutes later near the end of the game, there was a big altercation between the coaches and Skylar Diggins was getting really pissed and yelling over at the bench. It was just embarrassing. And Shannon Sharp now is calling these people out, calling the haters out. Shannon Sharp calls out WNBA for Caitlin Clark jealousy. Y'all mad because that corn-fed Iowa girl busting y'all ass. And I want to actually listen to this clip because it's pretty funny. The clear jealousy that so many people in the WNBA have against Caitlin Clark, even though she is actually raising the tide for all of them. Listen to this interaction right here. That trash. Hey, y'all stop this foolishness. Y'all oh, see the woman speed up. Y'all see her. Caitlin Clark is getting the crowd and right. going. Y'all see Skylar Diggins speed up to make contact with her. Stop this. Y'all oh. mad because that corn fed Iowa girl busting y'all ass. Y'all hey. said she too weak. She can't do this. She lead the WNBA in assist. She cook it. Let her cook. Hey. Let her cook. Uh, that's a pretty, pretty funny clip from Shannon Sharp. And it, it is true. We have seen this from the very beginning, from the Diana Taurasi saying, you know, it's going to be a different story. She looks good against 18-year-olds, but once she gets in the WNBA against real players, she's not going to look like that. Well, she has. You probably could have used her help on the Olympic squad. That's why you almost lost and choked away the gold medal to a French team that never should have even been that close. But this is just continuing the same story that we've seen time and time again over the last few years. For some reason, a lot of people, I don't know if it's just because Caitlin Clark is straight and white, or maybe it's truly just bitter jealousy because she is getting attention that you were not able to get. She's elevating the league when it's been irrelevant for 20 plus years. Will the Caitlin Clark hype continue? That remains to be seen. Will it be the same four or five years down the road? We'll see. Only time will tell. But right now, it's true, especially off the break, getting off this break and back into WNBA competition. WNBA players are furious that once again, Caitlin Clark is the story. Let me know what you think about this and Shannon Sharp's reaction in the comments section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.